All right. Welcome, everybody, to our stream of um, Sensible Golf. This is uh, a rarely... Uh, there weren't too many games made by Sensible that were poorly reviewed, but Sensible Golf is one of those games. Um, I'm going to see. I mean, I love golf games. Well, I like this already. <laughs> yeah. I do want to play golf. Actually, what I want to do is listen to this song a little bit more. Uh. Now, I can tell you for a fact that I've never played a golf game that had such a cool intro tune. Jops of Cannon Fodder fame. Of course, I guess Jops, uh, Cannon Fodder. Uh, yeah, this is, this is 95. This is a late release for the Amiga. So we are ready to play Sensible Golf. Twitch says I'm offline. I don't care. I'm going to refresh this page one more time. Just to see if that does anything. And uh, I'm just going to pop that up. Yeah, our stream, this OBS looks like it's working fine. So I don't know what Twitch's problem is. This is, this is straight to YouTube anyway. Unless you're watching on Twitch. Which is cool. Here we go. Play around. Oh, that's all right. I'm just going to pop out the chat. Okay, where should we play? Augusto? Casablanca? Wow. <laughs> An unbelievable amount of courses in this game. Um, Pittsburgh is relatively close to where I am, but I don't really want to play golf there. I think we'll just start with Augusta. This is Augusto. I think that's funny. So this is a par 74. Boat up. Drinking a uh, blue moon tonight. This is the, the peach, first peach uh, something. Anyway, it's a peach flavored blue moon. I like it. All right. So it looks to be a uh, your normal golf game fair with your cursor. Uh, I'm going to push the button. I think I'm going to be greeted with the uh, the gauge. Yep, there's the gauge. Now the trick is to figure out how it works. I'm going to hit once, hit again. Oh, no. That was a miss. Let's try it again. Hit once, hit it. Oh, okay. I might be doing something wrong. We're going to incorporate the joystick this time. Okay, that time I didn't push anything, and it didn't work. Uh, okay. Uh, there we go. So I guess you just have to hit it before you get to the red. That ding you hear, if you're watching this on YouTube, is my Twitch stream disconnecting. That's annoying. I don't know why it's doing that. Ooh, that's a miss. <laughs> no. Oh, I'm 
swinging too early. I wonder if they're, uh, yeah, they're definitely counting all those misses in my score total. Um, looks like they're automatically adjusting my clubs, uh, which is good. Um, let's just, maybe I'll get the hang of this. Oh, it's just, it's not very responsive in the way that you'd expect. I swear that I'm pushing the button in the red. Um, and if I try and push it earlier, it happens earlier. Nope. Boy, stroke 14. Oh. Okay. Try the sand wedge. Well, I hit it. Ooh, hit the pin. Okay. Now we'll just bring it around there. And how does putting work? Same way. I'm not quite sure that's how I want to line up. Maybe like that. Oof. Not pretty. That was a very hard hit shot. So if we hit it about the same string. Ooh. This is ugly. That was the first hole, plus 18. Uh, it's rarely a good thing when you shoot um, when you shoot more bigger than you do. Uh, let's just say that I've had several holes where I've done better in real life than in video game golf, and that's never a good sign. Play the next hole. Hey, at least we got at least we got off the tee the first shot. Even though we got to do it again. Okay. trying to pitch it away from that tree. Maybe just straight out like this. Out of bounds. <laughs> Unbelievable. Well, let's just go back to where we came from. I'll take it. Not bad. Too hard. This is 40 max. One to hole. Okay. So just that, even that may be too hard. Really? I thought I did much better that time. selection. There it is. Okay. Something like that. And but 
that wasn't even close to. Oh, I was using the sand wedge accidentally. That was kind of what I wanted to do. I'm going to pause for a moment to sneeze. False alarm. Didn't need to sneeze at all. Um, let's see. Okay, I think I can 185 to hold. I think if I hit this at full power, it should put me almost where I want to be. Out of bounds. We'll just try it again. Ooh, that's a miss. Played that game before. I feel like I'm getting better. So slowly but surely. Okay. So I'm going to hit this. I'm eight away. 40 max, 10, 20, 30, 40. That should be good. Oof. All right. So I scored 10 on that hole, but uh, that's all right. Yeah, you're going to need a boat for this hole. That was some of that uh, trademark Amigos humor. Okay. Go 240 to the hole. So if I do like three-quarter swing from right there. Hey! Sometimes you get a lucky bounce. And look at this. No. There's wind. 180 max, 170 to hole. Ooh. That was a mess. Come on. There we go. Oh, that's beautiful. Okay. Six to hole. Yeah, you really have no fine control if you're under if you're under ten feet. I mean I did that as fast as I could. Triple bogey. I feel that's worthy of a drink. It's the first time I've gotten a score that actually had a real name. check something on Twitch real, real quick. Yeah, we're good going. Good to go. Hey, if you're, if you're hanging out in the chat, say hello. Uh, I'd like to hear from you. You know what, I just, I did that on purpose, just to give myself a look at where I'm going. Okay, we want about a half swing here. Or maybe not. I guess it's hard to half swing with a driver. I can attest to that. We'll give it a full swing here. Forty-seven of the hole. Wind's with me. You know the wind always seems to be. I'm, I don't know if that's wind or not. That's blowing in that direction. Okay.
I'll take it. It's a par four, so this is for bogey. We need to hit it hard. Eleven of the hole, maybe like right there. Ooh, that's tricky. Ooh, thank you, crowd. I appreciate that. All right, we're moving through this here. I must say, though, I enjoy a good golf game. And uh, something like that in line in Mary Poppins, there's nothing like a good joke. Uh, anyway, this is, this is, it's all right. It's no, uh, eventually, I'm going to stream some leaderboard golf which is uh, a game that I played a lot on the original uh, 8088 PC that I had uh, growing up. It was my first... It was the other computer my family had. Um, I had an Atari 1200 XL that I shared with my brother and sister. My dad worked on work on this uh, IBM 8088 clone. Um, You know what? I take it back. I didn't play leaderboard golf on that. That was... I don't know what golf game I played on that. The leaderboard golf was on the, the Atari 1200. I remember it because um, my dad told me that he would buy a golf game if we ever saw one for the Atari. And of course, this was, you know, years after the Atari was relevant. You know, almost maybe five or six years after they stopped production. But we found this, there was this computer store that just happened to have one golf game that was compatible with the Atari 8-bits, and uh, he bought it, and that game was Leaderboard Golf. Um, I may try and find a box copy of it. Uh, I've got the baseball game that I played when I was a kid. I'm looking at it right now. It's called Star League Baseball. Uh, I've got the Commodore 64 version that I got uh, when I bought from somebody. and uh, But... I've never seen the 8-bit, the Atari 8-bit version, boxed in the wild. Oh, sand. Oh, not close enough. 38 to hole. 100 max. Maybe that's not enough. The I can see why this game was not praised because you need to have exact control with golf even with that gauge and you really don't have it in this game let's see 10 to hole I can do that that's in there bam well we're rapidly approaching the uh Let's see, we're hole eight, and uh, we're a little bit above par, but I'm having fun. Uh, oof. Out of bounds. I wish they'd bring back that uh, that golf, uh, the theme, you know, just randomly. You want to play golf? I had the sound low at the beginning of this, so you might not have heard that. But you can look it up on YouTube. Just chip it over there. That's that's pretty good. That's what I wanted to do. Okay. I'm going to have to hit this pretty much full strength to get it to carry. I didn't hit it full strength. But it carried over the sand. 24. So, I guess that's 20, 40, 60. I have no idea. We'll just swing it around there. 
that's too far. Just kind of cut across this nonsense, maybe just give it a good tap. That's, ooh, that's ugly. Yes! Boy, I was really fearing that that was going to be much more painful than it turned out to be. Okay, this is going to be our final hole. We're only going to play the front nine in this particular course. Um, looks like we just hit it kind of right there. Should be okay. It's tricky. 170 to the hole. I can draw. I can. I can swing for the hole. I feel like I might need to go up to the the, the fairway driver though. Yeah. I'm up and over the sand, which is what I wanted to do. And we'll just maybe go halfway. It's even hard to tell what halfway is with this crazy thing. Now we're on the green. We're going to have to hit it hard because the slope's against us. 20. Yeah. This is... That's in there. All right. Well, that was uh, Sensible Golf. Um... In game speech background by convenience. Okay, so you have some, you have some options here. Um, but yeah, that's sensible golf. Uh, I'm gonna shut this down and then start it back up, and we'll close with just one more one more round of that great great music. Oh. Uh. Yeah, it's got to be. I didn't notice that. Uh, Jules Chipper, and then uh, these are all the guys from Cannon Fodder. Stu, Chops. That's right. It's wonderfully, um, wonderfully 90s. It's great. All right, that'll do it for uh, Amigos Plays Sensible Golf. Uh, tune in again. Uh, keep watching our Twitch channel and uh, keep checking us out on YouTube. Of course, we've got the podcast. Everything's at AmigosPodcast.com. Uh, we'll see you soon. Adios.